travelers and people who give gifts to travelers. It's a Liz for Means to Travel. Welcome to my channel if you're new here and welcome back if you are returning. Today we're going to be talking about holiday stocking stuffer gift ideas for travelers specifically. So these are going to be small items that can fit in a Christmas stocking that would be really good for travelers. So I am a frequent traveler. I travel usually just every month out of the year. Um, over the past many, many years, I have been making videos about travel. And so over that time, I feel like I've been able to get some good ideas about what little items I might want to receive as a traveler that I think would be handy. And I think most travelers would agree with this. So if somebody in your life is traveling next year, or if somebody is perhaps a frequent traveler, these are gonna be great stocking stuffer ideas for them. All right, without further ado, let's make this quick and get right into it. The first idea I'm gonna share with you guys are TSA luggage locks. So if somebody travels frequently, they know that it would be handy to have TSA luggage locks even if they are not checking a bag. Let's say they are carrying their bag on the plane, but maybe they have a tight connection and there's a risk of having to gate check their bag. So if you gate check your bag, you might wanna throw on a luggage lock, have it at the ready in your personal item onto your bag on the jet bridge and having luggage locks just at the ready are gonna be really important. On top of that, if the person that you're giving the gift to stays at hotels a lot, they might be checking their bag with the bellhop for a little amount of time. Maybe they arrive early before they can check in to their room or they have a late night flight and need to have the hotel store their bag for the day. Having luggage locks when you have to put your bag into that storage area can be just an extra peace of mind. The next type of item I'm going to suggest, I mean, these are two examples, but there's tons out there, are lip balms with SPF in them. So this one has SPF 50, it's great for the beach, banana boat sport, and this one's Aquaphor Lip Protectant Plus Sunscreen, it has SPF 30, and having lip protectant with SPF in it is great if you're going to a sunny destination, but also great if you are traveling on an airplane because when you're up at elevation, you're actually getting exposed to a lot more sun, a lot more radiation, and having extra SPF both on your face and also on your lips is going to be key. So having a lip balm with SPF not everybody always buys that at the store, so it's great to have um, as a gift in the stocking. The next items I'm gonna talk about, whether they're for men or women, are going to be a travel size hairbrush. I really like the Goody and Connor brands that are in this shape here. And then also, I, um, if you're a guy or a girl, having just a comb at the ready in your bag, regardless of if it's in your personal item or in your check bag or something like that, that is travel size, that can come in a lot of handy too. I'm just gonna start putting these items into the stockings and the stocking itself so you can see that they all fit. <laughs> um, of course, you'll probably wanna wrap these with gift wrap or with tissue paper um, in order to make them a little bit more festive, but yeah, so far so good. We're just down here at the little toe of the sock. Next item I'm going to talk about today, I, I am missing one of them in here because it's actually in my suitcase as we speak, but these are little toothbrush holders. So they keep your, the brush of the toothbrush really sanitized and you, they're cleanable too, so you can wash them each time you use them. You put the bristles into the holder and then you snap it closed and then it keeps the toothbrush really clean as you travel. So definitely great ideas for travelers if they don't already have toothbrush holders. Next items are a pack of different size carabiner hooks. So. These are so handy, but you never know when you're going to need them. <laughs> I really like traveling with at least one carabiner hook, just so that way if I have to hook something to something else, then it makes it really easy. I can hook my water bottle to my bag. I can hook my um, airplane neck pillow to my bag. <laughs> you know, it's, uh, it's just really, really um, a great thing to have as a traveler. It's like having a toolbox at the ready. And here's another really interesting idea for putting into a stocking is a headlamp. So they're not just good for like backpacking or spelunking in a cave. <laughs> I mean, these have actually come in handy as flashlights for me while I travel. Um, one time I was staying at a hotel and the power went out, so I was so grateful to have this. But if I'm just driving at night, maybe want 
to have something more than just my phone as a backup of a flashlight. This has like really strong LED lights um, that go beyond just the phone flashlight. Then I'm not gonna shine it on you guys because I know it's gonna be super bright, but I promise it works. Maybe I'll turn it on over here. So there's a red and there's like a white one. It comes in, comes out. But yeah, so headlamps can be really great for that. But also, um, if there's just an LED flashlight that you want to get somebody to, it, that's really small, that they can bring with them, that can be really handy. The next item I'm going to suggest is, this is more than just a nail clipper. This is actually a cuticle slash hang nail clipper. And you can see, there's like an angled head to it that's different from a nail clipper but, and it has an extra extension. This is made by Tweezerman, I've had it for years. I have purchased it multiple times over the, like I think this is my second or third one. And I've had this particular one for like 10 years. This is amazing. And when I travel at least, my hands and my fingernails and all of that gets super dry. So it's nice to have little clippers that are specifically made for hangnails and hangnail prevention. Um, I bring this with me on every single trip that I go on and it has come in such good handy. So definitely something that most people don't own and would make a really good stocking stuffer. And I wouldn't be a really smart traveler if I didn't bring hand cream with me when I traveled, especially on the airplanes. Um, these are two of my favorites. I really like the Kiehl's and Derek actually uses this one a lot too because it has very neutral scent. Um, it comes in lots of different sizes. This is two and a half fluid ounces. So it is carry on safe um, to bring within your liquids bag. And this one's even smaller. This one's less than one fluid ounce from Aveda. I really like the scent of this one in particular, but um, you know, scents can be very personal. So I wouldn't necessarily just get something really heavily scented if you're going to be gifting. Definitely think about maybe getting a more neutral scent, more gender neutral scent, um, nothing that's overpowering. Um, because that way you know that that receiver is going to like it. Another item that I've already done a review video for on this channel is this EnviroSax bag. So um, it comes in a lot of different patterns. Mine's really girly, but there are some more neutral, gender neutral ones as well. Um, but it, this is basically a shopper bag that rolls up really small and it holds so much weight. So I think it holds up to 40 pounds when it's unrolled. And it, you can just smush and squish this bag in between all of your things and your luggage really easily. And then it unrolls to a very large bag. You can use it as a beach bag, a shopper bag. And I've even had scenarios where I had to gate check my bag that had some camera gear in it. When I got to my gate really late when I was flying and I transferred all that camera gear into this bag and put it in the overhead bin, kind of tied up a little bit with the handles all tied up like so and honestly it was so handy to have this just in my bag that i could whip out real quick when i had to make sure that all of the items that were in my carry-on were safe all right so i'm not going to roll it up back I'm just going to stuff it in there next item i'm going to talk about this is the gillette travel size razor I love this thing because it actually fits the standard size razor blades. So you can buy just regular size razor blades at the store and you can even put the men's Gillette razor blades on the end of this as well. It's like all the same sizes for the attachments. And so Derek and I, when we travel, we actually just bring this guy if we're trying to save a lot of space and we each have our own blades with us and we just use the same handle and share the handle and then have our own blades for sanitary reasons. So it's really cool. You can even, um, it even always comes with this case. Definitely a really cute thing for a female traveler, but also a really practical thing for all travelers. And if you followed my channel for a while, you guys have heard me talk about how much I love using reusable bottles when I travel. It, I think it saves a lot of money, honestly, because like this, this is like, I don't know, $1.99. This, I think maximum $2.99 or $3.99. And these are Nalgene branded plastic reusable bottles and jars that you can buy at the container store or on Amazon. 
that have wide mouths. So I have my face wash in here from La Roche Posay and I use my label maker to, to put the label onto the actual item itself. So that way when I travel, I am able to just refill this with, you know, like the master that I have in my bathroom at home. Then this is my Aveda shampoo. And again, I've used my label maker. I've been using this for a while, so it kind of looks a little bit washed away, <laughs> but it's still there. Um, and this is a larger size that I took with me for the entire three and a half months that I was away um, this past spring for our road trip across the US, but they come in much smaller sizes too, like one ounce, one fluid ounce bottles, that sort of thing. And you can really save a lot of space in your liquids bag by using these refillable bottles that are smaller sizes than maybe what you have at home. Next items I'm gonna quickly talk about. Um, this is very kind of like 2021, 20, 2022 specific for travel for sure, maybe even beyond, and that is PPE. You can put like some of these travel size wet one wipes that somebody might wanna bring with them when they are going on in an airplane. Maybe they're gonna be stopping at rest stops on their road trip, that sort of thing. And this is actually a teeny tiny spray hand sanitizer that I got at Whole Foods and it has a French lavender scent spray. So it's kind of like, ooh, I get to think about France a little bit every time I spray my hands with hand sanitizer when I travel and it has a nice scent. So that way you are kind of like taken to the beautiful lavender fields of Provence in order to fight those germs. So the next thing I'm going to share is my powder dry shampoo for my cure. It's the rosemary and peppermint for all hair types version. This one you can find on Amazon or at Whole Foods or even tar some targets will carry it. And it's really great because you use it as a powder in your hair in order to go in between washes if you can't wash your hair every day. And it will absorb all of those oils for you. And so that way if you don't have the time to use shampoo, you can definitely use the dry shampoo. I, when I'm at home, use a spray, like liquid-based dry shampoo, and this powder one is great for travel because it lets me avoid having to put it into my liquids bags. So this is a great stocking stuffer idea for travelers who have long hair and hair maintenance that they have to think about when they are on the go. And the very last stocking stuffer idea I'm going to share is a travel size loofah. So I love loofahs. Um, I know that not everybody does. Totally fine if you're like a washcloth person. If you are a washcloth person, a great gift idea would, instead of this, would be a microfiber washcloth that's quick dry. So having a quick dry thing when you're traveling can be so key. And a lot of countries, washcloths aren't as prominent, especially in hotels. And so having a washcloth in your luggage might be really, really just a bonus. But this is a travel size loofah. It's from The Body Shop. You can get them anywhere. You can get them at Target, on Amazon, and they're just way smaller and cuter and make a great stocking stuffer. And that's it. So my stocking is pretty full now. <laughs> um, I hope you guys liked this video of all of my stocking stuffer ideas. And if you did, please give it a thumbs up down below. And as always, if you haven't already, please press that red subscribe button below. And that way you won't miss any of the travel tips, travel product reviews, and other travel videos on this channel to come. Thanks everybody for watching. Cheers, happy travels, and happy holidays. Bye. Hey travelers, don't forget to subscribe and let's hang out more. Here are some links to other helpful travel videos on my channel and press that notification bell so you don't miss any new and awesome travel videos to come.